Okay, uh, let's make a trip to the caravan. Uh, yeah, iron pickaxes and bug nets. Yeah, I'm pretty much good for those. Yeah, let's take the insect uh, glaive and for... Let's take it for a go against the Jagia. Den Mothers slay five Jagia and there is no subquest. Those dumb Jagia think they're so tough. They're all like, ooh, I, sh I could sure go for a kid's face to gnaw on about now. Grr, go raid their stupid lair on the ancestral steppe. Alright, we're on a hunting quest this time around. We gotta slay five Jagia. Hey, uh, Doodle, are you all excited for today's amazing quest? You don't say. Well, before you start, let me explain the rules for slaying quests. It's pretty obvious stuff. The guild insists I give new hunters the rundown. It's some kind of liability thing. Anyway, to complete a slaying quest, you need to slay the designated monster a set number of times. Oh, and don't worry if you lose track of how many monsters you have left to take down. Just press start, select quest info from the menu to see your current tally. Your silence will be accepted as legally binding confirmation that you understand and accept these terms. Good luck. Okay, grab all the usual stuff. And off we go to slay a few Jagia. And hopefully mine stuff, because I'm going to be needing a lot of iron ore in the future. So many, uh, so much bomb material to make. And I keep forgetting to um, gather at these gathering points. Yeah, I've made it really far into the game on my other file. I've already slain the offline final boss. And I'm on to higher end quests. Like, all the new monsters, there's so much fun. They're hard, but there's so much fun. Who would have thought I actually enjoy fighting Tigrex now? I actually like fighting Tigrex. Like, how weird is that? That is beyond strange. In Freedom Unite, oh my goodness. My friend and I just got back. Yeah, it was on the last day of classes before we had the week off. We brought our PSPs. And we decided to play Monster Hunter Freedom Unite together. And we... Uh, because I hadn't got... Because I've only gotten up to high rank on Freedom Unite. My urgent quest was to hunt two Tigrexes in the uh, snowy mountains. It was actually surprisingly easy, but it was still frustrating. It was a lot easier than I expected with uh, two players. I thought it would I thought we would be absolutely slaughtered, but no, we got by with only one death. Okay, that's a jaggy, but I'm gonna kill you anyway. Oh look, butterfly. I'm just gonna pause in my killing of the jaggies in order to catch some uh, butterflies. Oh, hip check. Mega fishing fly. No, not what I wanted to do. Get back here, bug. Okay, and that one Jagia. Okay, uh, you can carve Jagia twice, because they're a lot larger than Jaggy. Now, if only that logic applied to other monsters. I mean, honestly. 
Velociprey are like three times a jaggy size. And they only give one carve. Nope. Jaggy, over here. I can't see. View up. And that's a jaggy height if I ever saw one. Yeah, over to area four, there's always some jaggia in area four. Oh yeah, look, there's one over there. But first mining. Priorities, folks, priorities. And I hate how often iron pickaxes break. It's not fun. Let me carve this Jagia. I know you're mad that I've killed it, but still. Not cool. Monster Bone S. I don't think I've ever gotten a Monster Bone S from a Jaggy or a Jagia in this game. I mean, I know it's... Like I said in the previous recording session, carving and gathering, it's all up to luck, really. But still, I don't think I've ever gotten a Monster Bone S from these guys. Wow. Nice uh, teamwork there, Kyle. Yeah, that was three Jagia so far. We're going to check seven to see if there's anything. But uh, I think I, I don't think so. I don't think there will be anything. But I know what there will be, and there will be mining points. Mining points I can exploit. Over here. Uh, you know what? We should take a first aid med. And I can't use the mini whetstone when I'm on a ledge. I suppose that makes sense. Like, I need two hands. Oh my god, my pickaxes are breaking like no one's business. Oh look, uh, Kunchu. Um, I don't think there are any mining points up here, but I'm gonna check anyway. Nope, don't even think about it, but you've been a habra. And if that conchu had hit me, I would have been mad. Uh, nothing. We'll check at the tippy top. And it doesn't look like there's anything. So we're going to go to area 9. No, we're going to head to 6, and then we're going to go to 9. Okay, so this is the wyvern's nest. It's We're just passing through. And you know what? I better take my last ration. Okay, no jaggy here. But there is a mining spot. So... Oh, are these the soldiers? I don't think so. No, they're not soldiers. So they won't attack me on sight. That's just because I felt like it. Bug nets are breaking a lot too. Okay, we've had our fun in Area 6. We're going to head out to 9. 
I think we got a brief look at 9 in the last recording session as I was looking for Kelby. Uh, 9 is over yonder. Off this ledge. And that is one heck of a drop. First things first, there is a mining spot all the way up here. Yeah, see right there. And I have to be careful because last time I tried getting this mining spot, I actually accidentally fell off the edge. Okay. Last few targets. So, carve you up. And I see two Jaggy and my the last Jaggia. So, yeah, this isn't going to be any trouble. Maybe we'll even get a few of these Jaggy while we're at it. And we'll get you, then go back for the others. And that's quest complete. Thanks. I really needed that. You know, where's that other Jaggy? The one that, like, was almost finished off. Is it you? No, it's not you. This is the other Jaggy I was looking for. Oh, you know, there's poop over there. We're gonna try to get the poop. Yeah, dung, lots of it. We want that dung. We're getting a lot of nullberries, though. I didn't know Jaggy ate nullberries. Like, assuming this is Jaggy poop. I I'm assuming this is Jaggy poo. Because this is like a Jaggy nest. Although a lot of large monsters do come here to sleep, so this is more of a generic sleeping area, I suppose. Like, I remember in Monster Hunter 3 Ultimate, there were two Jaggy nests. Like, it felt like they were specifically for Jaggy because they were small, and they always had Jaggy in them. This area is much larger, and I've seen a lot of monsters come here to sleep, like Gormagala. I think uh, Tigrex I caught in here once or twice. Actually, no, just once. There was only one Tigrex quest in the Ancestral Steppe. 